what is going on movie meals two trailers dropped this morning i'm at work so of course this is the day <laughs> that it happens watch this be the day 15 teachers come in and want to talk to me um or which works, rarely kids. happens <laughs> yeah um Anyway, we're here for Stranger Things season four. Looks like they just dropped a teaser trailer. We've gotten a teaser trailer before because they had revealed that our boy is not dead. Um, David Harbour, who we thought would be dead because that. he was he was going to go on to bigger and better things. And then his Hellboy movie didn't work out. So um, uh, he's back. Uh, so I'm curious what this will bring. I didn't love season three. I liked season three. Um, it was basically the same thing as season two. The only difference was is the relationships they created in season two got fleshed out in season three so it worked out uh, i mean it was okay but i'm i'm ready to go into the upside down i'm tired of the same will freaking out storyline where they just do the same <laughs> thing and the monster attacks again i i really want the, them to bring the fight to them so i'm really mm -hmm. curious what they're gonna do uh what do you think um it's i guess it has been a while since i've watched stranger things but um, I'm just, I am like you, I am ready for them to shake things up. I'm ready to see, um, a lot more of, you know, the upside down and a lot more of like what's going on within there. And, you know, I'm just excited to see these characters as well and get themselves flushed out even more. Yeah, me too. All right. You ready? Yep. Totally. A three, a two and a one. children Good morning, Papa. how are you today Good, Papa. Good I'm glad to hear it because today I have something very special planned for you Eleven are you listening? That was it? Oh my gosh. Oh, that was it. <laughs> thought we would get way more than that for a minute and a half. Um, well, let's give a little bit of fairness. At least they actually did like a real teaser where normally, you know, Fast and Furious gave us, a, what was it, a three minute teaser trailer? <laughs> so who knows uh, how these things work? What did you think, I guess? It certainly teased me. Um, it's kind of similar to how they teased us with that uh, David Harbour video of revealing yeah. that his character's alive. Uh, it feels like it's in the same tone, which is good, I guess. Um, I guess, like, if you're looking deep into this video, like that, uh, the hockey puck thing or whatever it is, Landon, not seven. I wonder if that means what, there was a character in season two that they introduced who's like 11 and she was called seven i think right am i thinking of that name right i do i do remember the like brothers and sisters that also escaped um but yeah. i don't remember their names because i hated the storyline <laughs> yeah it didn't work there uh but i wonder if they're actually going to bring that into season four and hopefully do it a bit better than what they did earlier or if they're just gonna say nah forget about that like we're going to do something different here um, in this case. So that's the only thing that I was really like analyzing throughout this thing. But yeah, for the most part, it's, you know, a teaser. I, I kind of wish at this point that we did get a trailer just so that way I can get more excited because it has been yeah. a while since I've seen Stranger Things. Um, but I'm sure once this season drops, I'll be hooked back into it just like I was with seasons one and three and two to an extent. But yeah, not two, two. Two, I just didn't like the side plot with her. I didn't mind that she had siblings. All that made sense, but I just didn't, I just didn't like that she, I don't know. The side plot just didn't work. I thought it missed the mark on what it could have been. Um, yeah, I love season one. Season three, I, I thought was pretty good. Season two is okay. Um, but I'm just, I hope they take the fight to the upside down. This really was just a tease. Um, it looks like we're going to get, I guess, more of her backstory and, you know, her siblings, whatever that is. Um, 
if they bring seven back, I guess that'd be interesting. I guess they're going to need an army if they're going to go into the upside down, which I just assume they are. Hope so, because I feel like the creators have been talking about going into the upside down forever. Remember when that, that report came out that they had had like, that they had written like 700 pages of like what the upside down entails, like what it is and like how it works and everything that's inside of it and everything. Like, I want to see that. I don't, I don't want to see, I don't want to see the same thing again. Um, Let's go to the mall. <laughs> yeah. Um, uh, and I hope they finally do something more with the Russian plot line because they just kind of keep teasing the Russians outside of in season three, the one funny dude we had, but. Um, I think yeah. I'm going to give the show a rewatch this summer. When is it coming out season four? Because they didn't have a release date on the end of that. Uh, you, that's a good point too. They didn't say a release date for that. And I have no idea. Let me look it up. I here. thought it was this summer. That's what they I thought. They always take place too. at a holiday. Um, where they have the last few. All I'm seeing right now is summer, spring. Wait a minute. Right now, I'm seeing spring or summer of 2022. That can't be right, though. Man, if Netflix is holding on to Stranger Things for that long, that is a bad call. Uh, maybe someone in the comments section can uh, look this up for us, because I am not able to find a release date for this Please thing. do. Uh, maybe they don't yeah, have one. Maybe that's why they didn't show it. But if, hmm. honestly, I think they should go back to Halloween. And they should drop it when it when horror is at its peak, which which they did with the first season, if I remember correctly. Mm -hmm. uh, but yeah. Anyway, guys, what did you think? Comment below. Let us know. Remember to like, subscribe, share. Thank you to our patrons who I forgot to thank at the beginning of the show in two videos because I'm just flabbergasted today. Um, <laughs> thank you to Steve, Kimberly, Karen. You guys are amazing. All the patrons go become a member. Everything's linked in the description. Uh, lots of cool stuff dropping. And as uh, always, thanks for watching, Mom. See you guys.